Hi, fourth graders. Tonight we're going to watch a video to prepare us for our lesson tomorrow. I can use technology to produce and publish writing. What are some of the things you see in this photograph? You may have said flowers, a lamp, a sofa, books, pillows, windows, a blanket, a coffee table. Well, yes, all of those things, and maybe more. What have we been studying in math? That's right, we've been studying angles. In this picture, we see a lot of angles but we also see books on the coffee table. They are actually called coffee table books. Coffee table books are books usually about one topic in particular with a lot of different pictures about that topic and text related to the topic. We are going to make our very own coffee table book. Remember in class the other day we went on a walk around school and were taking pictures of different angles we saw? And then yesterday we wrote a poem called a chincane about the angle we saw in the picture we took. Using that photo and that poem we are going to make our very own coffee table book. We are going to learn how to use an application that lets us edit our photos and add words on top of that photo. Here is a quick mini lesson. Maybe you want to try with a picture you have on your iPad. If not, that's okay. We will work on it in class tomorrow. Select the photo from the iPad gallery. Tap on the Edit button at the top right-hand side of the screen. Select the circle with the three dots in the middle. Select the circle with the plus sign in the middle. Select the arrow tool. Using the arrow tool, you will draw rays over the angle you selected in the picture. Save the image by tapping the Done button. Go to your home screen and select the PicMonkey app. Find the picture you added the angle to. Select the Text tool. Type in your Syncane you can try different fonts, sizes, and colors. Touch the check mark on the top right hand side to save your finished image. Afterwards, we will print the pages to make our book. We will also publish it on our classroom blog. I can't wait to see the final result. See you tomorrow.